Uh, Eric did that recently with mailing in my man shirts. We're like, uh, I'm mailing, I'm costing the company like $100 because we got the address wrong. Well, now like, I feel uh, worse that she compared me to Eric. Well, I'm just saying, <laughs> that was a, a similar uh, situation. What did you screw up uh, at your job or at your work? 877-995-4681 to call. You can text 99338. Uh, this morning, like at 530, like the biggest websites in the world were all down at the same time. It was a little bit of like, oh, is this the end of the world? What's happening here? And so The Verge, like they're like an entertainment site. Um, they had a what at the time was a good idea. Like, okay, our website's down. Yeah. We're going to tweet a Google Doc, and this is how we'll update people and keep them posted on what's going on. Because it was like Amazon yeah. was down, and Reddit was down, and Twitch was down, and like Facebook. Crazy and lumber. it was like uh, maybe 30 seconds until the internet realized, well, the Google Doc wasn't like blocked it wasn't like locked anybody, anybody could, could edit get it. to it and the internet did what the internet does started posting memes yep. on the doc started posting things like who's the silly sausage that left this unlocked started posting uh, gifts <laughs> it was great and like whoever like did it yeah. like the verge tweet out later like next time the world ends we'll find something better kind of funny i know it's like somebody there definitely made the not a mistake is the word i know it was, it was a weird weird time but like you know like there's going to be like a company meeting now at like a bunch of companies like that like if we tweet out google doc like best to make sure that it's locked yes or best to make yeah. sure you have a company email to edit what was yours i can't think of, for me like there's um so these lamps outside the studio uh a couple years well man, like eight years ago uh eric and i were playing like kickball in the hallway uh, allegedly, and then because we were playing catch, I think, with a football and broke one of the lights. And the managers at the time said it was like a five thousand dollar light fixture because it was Italian glass. Oh my! Gosh. And I remember at the time thinking, like, if that's true, like, what a waste! I, don't, I think yeah. they're just messing me. But that was like the most notable one I have as far as a work mess up. Riley, do you have one off the top of the dome, like a, a giant work mistake? Yeah, one time when I was a receptionist before I got into radio, it was my job to send out this order, and it was just a small box of like paperwork. But I guess it was like their big money maker for the month or whatever. Okay. And I messed up the address by two like i inverted the, the address oh by whoopsies. two numbers yeah so it didn't get there on time and it cost them a lot of money funny enough i had a job after that uh eric did that recently with mailing in my man shirts we're like uh, a mailing i'm costing the company like a hundred dollars because we got the address wrong well, now like, i feel uh, worse that she compared me to eric well i'm just saying <laughs> that was a, a similar uh, situation yeah uh, rose how about you have a giant script of work um yeah i put a catering catering order in like for the wrong date like the Ooh. day they were going to pick it up was wrong. Luckily, they called the day before and like made sure everything was good to go. But I just like put it on, yeah, the wrong date at that oh, time. Oh, that'd be a, that'd be a you heart know attack. Was another one last yeah. year. Yes. Remember when I had those custom um, donuts made for Lyra, or for Marshall's birthday with the marshmallow faces on? I them? do indeed. Yes. Oh my god, they did an amazing job. It worked out. But the ticket they did old school tickets. It fell behind the counter. So we oh. literally went in town. To Florida for said donuts, and I showed up there ready to get his birthday cakes. Or gir- and they're like, "Uh, we don't have the oh, order." No. Oh, they my. fixed it, and it yeah. was fine, and ended up great. But I was like, "Wait a minute, no! This is his huge birthday surprise." Oh, that would suck. That yeah, was, that'd be the giant heart attack. What did you screw up at work, uh, Janie? Good morning. Hello. Hey, so you? Uh, <laughs> oh hi. Hey, you do. Hello. You do what an accident. Hey. <laughs> So I, uh, when I was at, so I used to work for a payroll company and we did payroll for a bunch of different companies. One was for like a hospital. So we paid all these doctors. Obviously doctors get paid like a ton of money, each payroll, thousands Mm -hmm. and thousands of dollars. So once there was a a glitch when I submitted payroll and I accidentally paid everybody double their salary. (laughs) Oh, whoopsies. Oh my God. People were real happy with you that day. Well, I Thank God went into panic mode because obviously, you know, the blood left my body. Sure. And I was like, oh, my God, I'm going to, like, get fired. So I had to call the, um, you know, I had to call the banks. I had to call, like, our bank, you know, and figure out, like, what, you know, I had to just, I had to put, like, a complete stop to it. Thank God, like, last second. Because they're like, well, the payroll deadline passed. I said, you don't understand. Oh, did <laughs> this you? This is like an emergency. Yeah. So, did so you... thank God I actually halted it before it went through. Yeah. I was going to say, so when you wow. first realized That's it, did you like crazy. stop and go, okay, let me just double check to make sure? Or was it somebody else was like, hey, just so you know. Well, okay, so when it submits, you know, we get a like a report. Like, this is the payroll yeah. you just submitted. Oh, so I noticed yeah. that, you know, I was like, this is a little higher than normal. A lot higher than normal. <laughs> and I noticed that under each person's name, it 
was just double. I did the math, and I'm like, oh, they're all doubled. Oh, wow. My. That, okay. that would be that moment the whole world stops. There was like, um, oh, yeah. Every now and then, like, that's happened here before. I've had like a former boss call and be like, hey, we accidentally paid you too much this last time. So we, yeah. we need, we need to take it back. I'm like, oh, okay, that's, sure. that's nice. Hey, thanks. Thank you. Oh, man. I already <laughs> took all the money out of my account and closed it. And you're, sick. yeah, yeah. And like, well, I'm yeah. just going to work a little bit harder. I'm going to work as if I'm making $7 an hour instead of six. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Janie, thank <laughs> exactly. you so much for calling. Have a great day. Yeah. Of course. Bye. Thank you. Uh, let me go. A fake name Lisa needs a voice change. Hold on. Real okay. Quick. I'm going to do a little bit of this right here. Put that right there. Okay. Uh, fake name Lisa. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. So you, you were doing what at work and what happened? Yeah. So, you know, you're not allowed to smoke or vape inside of an office. But yeah. I was having a super busy day. And so I found an empty office. And I just, you know, vaped for like 10 minutes, got it out of my system and went back to my desk. And I didn't realize that there was a gentleman in the adjoining office. And I guess some of the vape came up through the ceiling. And, was, and before I knew it, I heard him screaming that there was fire. And I just sat at my desk. Oh, oh no. Oh, and they called me. Do you still work for the same company? Yeah, I, I do. Okay. Are we at work right I now? Do. I wouldn't. Oh, and we're, yeah. Oh okay. God. That's funny. We're, we're actually in an empty office, funny enough. Oh, well, there we go. Okay. Now, is is the vape, is it like uh, medicinal or is it just like vape, vape? Yeah, just vape, vape. Well, I mean, <laughs> at, at this okay. point, I mean, yeah. yeah. That, oh God, I mean, I think it's a funny story. It's like one of those things where, like, whenever you leave the company, you can be like, and by the way, uh, that wasn't a fire, idiots. That was just me. Okay. Yes. I could have so easily said, "I'm so sorry, it was just me," but I left the whole thing unfold. I feel terrible. No, nah, I, right. I think it's <laughs> nah. It could be far worse. You give you can pay people double. I think that'd be or print out your boss's W two oh, the wrong printer. God. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Anyways, that's it. Fake name Lisa, thank you so much for calling. Have a great day. <laughs> Have a great day, my man. Oh, my man. 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 Oh, that's so funny. And like I have this to have although when there's a fire here, uh we don't leave. We don't. And we hear the fire alarms yeah. because they do tests and we're just kinda like, Oh, okay, it's just yeah. another test. So if there was a real one, we'd be screwed. But there was a time, uh, there's a real one I think before you started, Riley. So it was me and Eric and Kane was still here too, and it was uh the fire alarm went off and Eric and Kane and I were like, Well, we're not gonna go anywhere, it's fake. The firefighters came to the floor and said, you need to leave the building now. We're like, oh, okay. Turns out that one is, one is a, real. a real one. Yeah, so you can uh, keep right. texting in your, your job message stories, 99338. 